Ladies and gentlemen, we have some exciting news to discuss today. Things that could directly, you know, hint towards what units we will be getting for anniversary. Yes, Dragon Ball Legends, fourth anniversary. That again, we have a reveals and stuff coming up on the 28th. And if we look at a calendar here, it's the 12th, 28th, as you can see here is it's right there. We're like, we're like two weeks away. So we are literally right there for Dragon Ball Legends fourth anniversary. But what we're going to be discussing today is the addition of Zenkai Zamasu and Zenkai Super Saiyan Goku from the movie back into the shop. Now, if you already have MZ7, you, they don't even put, like, you can't even see the banner when you go in-game to look at it. But these banners are there if you don't have MZ7 and, you know, you want to get either of these guys Z7, you can go for it. But it's interesting that they added these two banners back because I saw this tweet from LFBaby1 over here on Twitter. And it says, so two main and units will be purple god key and yellow movies if last year's scheme still works. Last year, they brought back Super 17, a green GT unit. And then for anniversary, we got green Super Saiyan for Gogeta. And then Super Gogeta came back as well, a red fusion warrior. And we got Zamasu, who is a fusion warrior. I know that may not be the first thing you think of when you think of the Zamasu we got for anniversary, but he is. He is, in fact, one. And... When you look here on Legend Space, you can see here, these are the two anniversary banners from last year, the one with Gogeta and the one with Zamasu. And then before it, bam, right there, we have the Super 17 and the Super Gogeta banners. So this year, if you take a look, we got these two, which is why LF Baby here is saying if it still works the same, because Legends can change things up, and this, this could just be they happen to bring these two back, but... I don't know like i feel like that would be weird to just bring these two back now the goku wouldn't be as weird with the current trend we've been getting because this guy is a movies unit so you know we've had him for movies these two are movies units obviously gamma one and two are from the new movie and then we just got a zenkai for a movie unit but however with all of this going on it does really make me think we will be getting a new movies unit so potentially we could be getting something from the new movie from dragon ball super superhero and not just something from an old movie or we could be getting something because anniversary is a hype time maybe we get a transforming gogeta from uh gogeta to gogeta blue super gogeta to gogeta blue whatever the heck they decide they want to do that could be something that we could potentially have because we already have a transforming gogeta to super gogeta you know from the broly movie from way back the blue one i'm sure y'all remember his zenkai now but that could be something that I feel like would be super hype for a anniversary character. People love Gogeta Blue. It would be giving us a new one. So all the Gogeta Blue fanboys would be going hype. I know Billy would probably lose his mind. But that is something that could be very hype. And just like the first thing that pops in my mind for movies. Then of course we could get a Broly. Like the Z Broly. That could be something that a lot of people have been asking for. Maybe we get an LF Z Broly finally. That would be something that could be really cool for movies that again a lot of people would be excited about the only i i say gogeta like it pops into my mind quicker than broly does because he's a fusion and anniversary we just have always had fusions connected super vegeto vegeto blue then last year super saiyan 4 gogeta and zamasu are both fusions so yeah i don't know we'll see but this is certainly something interesting and if we get a purple god key now, I know a lot of people have been on the train of MUI Goku. MUI Goku is coming. Now, he definitely could be. I'm not ruling it out, but I will say I would not get your high like I would not set your hope levels to like you're 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 convinced he's coming. I wouldn't do that to yourself just yet. But if we do get a purple god key and if it is MUI, that would be very interesting because we already have UI sign who's purple, so MUI would kind of just basically replace him i mean you don't run him anyway you shouldn't be running ui sign i'm just gonna say it he's the amount of times i come up against people who use that man and then they get absolutely one shot it's <laughs> it's far too high but this is certainly something to be interested in now i know the gt fanboys would be very sad if we don't get anything gt related for our anniversary but I don't know we haven't been seeing a lot of gt stuff and i actually pulled up dragon ball legends twitter and i scrolled all the way back to last year to look at what they were posting to see you know what they were talking about we got the zenkai for super saiyan 4 here on may 5th which if i pull up let's see where's goresh's video yes 
I wanted to confirm the dates here because some of the dates are like a little weird between Legend Space and Twitter and everything. But uh, Goresh's video here, he always like posts these showcases like as soon as they come out. So you can see he, we have the showcase for the Super Saiyan for Goku on May 5th. So just like it says here, we got the Goku on May 5th. And so that was GT. He's GT. Then they posted this picture. That's very GT related, quite obviously. This was on May 7th last year, which is even earlier than our current date is. Then we keep scrolling through the Twitter last year because, you know, you got to look at the trends when you're trying to determine what the heck they're, you know, going to do. We got the Legends Future Banner, which if we scroll back to uh, jump back to the past here, let's see, where's that Legends Future Banner? Ah, there it is. Here's the Legends Future Banner, which again, we did get a whole Future Banner for Anniversary with the whole Zamasu and Vegito Blue. Kefla was on there too, so it's more like a Fusion Banner, I suppose, but these two obviously were connected to the future Trunks arc, obviously. So we can clearly see the hints back then being formed with the release of a Zenkai for Super Saiyan 4, this post about GT characters, then us getting the, um, I believe this is a co-op about GT characters. Then we get the future banner here. So that's about the future characters. Then we got our, then we got, did we get the, we, yes. Then we got the all-star banner. I didn't know if the all-star banner came out before or after the legends future, but yes. Then we got the legends all-star with 17 and 18, which obviously doesn't connect to either of the anniversary, you know, uh, units that we ended up getting but then they posted this what are strengths and weaknesses of super 17 in the game which i feel like is a very odd post for them but this was clearly gt related hinting towards gt this is even the green gt unit further you know hinting towards us getting super saiyan 4 gogeta then they released the extreme zenkai awakening for the future extreme gohan another future unit would directly correlates to zamasu because he is a future unit when we're looking at our two LFs, they have, they brought, what is this? They bring back the, ah, they made this a permanent thing. The Trunks, which Trunks is a future. And then let's see, is there anything else before we finally get to our, they made the Spirit Bombs and Kai Awakening. That doesn't directly connect to the anniversary. Um, we got the Goku events. They posted this hint. They posted this hint on May 24th last year. Which, so, maybe we'll get something, when is that, 24th? Maybe we'll get something before our reveals and stuff. They'll post a fun hint, that would be fun. Uh, I'm always down for hints. They always make the game super, like, it's a lot of fun trying to guess those hints, at least in my opinion. But as you can see here, just me scrolling through, before we get to all these Gokus, they had a lot of GT, and then that future thing, and then just looking at the summons as well. We got this LF, then we got the future banner, then of course, we had the uh, Super 17 in there. They were giving us lots of hints. While this year, if we look at Dragon Ball Legends Twitter, they're posting these calendars, which the calendars literally have all a range of characters. So I wouldn't look too much into the calendars if you're trying to determine, you know, what unit we're going to get from those. Because literally, we got Shallot, then we got Krillin, then we got Fat Boo, then we got Beerus, um, then we got Kid Bulma, Youth Bulma, not Kid, Youth Bulma. Yeah, the, the, the calendars are really not a good, like, indicator. But besides the calendars, they obviously posted about the Dragon Ball superhero thing, which is a movie. Then they posted about the Zenkai, four great Sandman 1 and 2, who buff red movies. And they're a movies unit, obviously, to buff red movies. They have to be a movies unit, but you get the point. And then, interestingly, they retweeted this movie trailer from Crunchyroll about Dragon Ball Super superhero that you can see here on your screen. I believe Dokkan also retweeted this, just like, you know, to have something to think about but yes that is interesting then we have another wallpaper and that's about all we've gotten so far but again we still have about two weeks till anniversary so let me know your guys thoughts do you think that we will be getting a purple god key or uh yellow movies as our new units i mean if it is a yellow movie i don't think it would be another i don't think they'd make a transforming gogeta blue yellow when we already have a yellow gogeta blue that would just seem very odd to me. We could get... Now, Gogeta Blue could technically fall into both these categories, but I doubt they'd do a movie's exclusive anniversary. I feel like they would do at least two tags. But you could say Gogeta Blue is a god key unit, and they could make purple Gogeta Blue and then like a yellow Broly. But again, 
two LFs? Because I'm assuming it's going to be two LFs again for this anniversary since last anniversary. Third anniversary was, of course, two LFs. And again, we're getting, like, monthly LFs, although now we have ultras in the mix as well. So, yeah, certainly a lot to think about. A very interesting point posed here by LF Baby. Glad he pointed this out because I don't know if I would have necessarily just remembered that off the top of my head since I don't have a encyclopedia of all the Legends banners just built up in there. But it definitely seems like we're going to be getting some sort of movie-related unit, whether it's directly correlated to the new Dragon Ball Super superhero movie, or if it's just a movie's unit from either the Broly movie or the old Broly movie. Um, I don't think it's going to be, like, cooler or anything like that, but I suppose it could be. It could be. We'll have to wait and see. But I just feel like with how much people have been talking about wanting a new LFZ Broly, something we don't have, Wanting, everyone always wants a new Gogeta Blue, uh, or just to give the other one a Zenkai. Something to think about. Something to think about. Just wanted to pose this, so let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments down below. Do you think we're going to be getting either a purple, you know, God Key? I guess this could be a future as well. Zamasu is a future unit. Zamasu is also a powerful opponent unit, so that's another thing that could, you know, be tied into there. Techn Zamasu has a lot of tags, <laughs> now that I'm really thinking about it. But, um... You know what? Actually, hold on. Let me make. Let me check. I don't. I think it's gonna. If they show Zamasu, it, it they don't normally get like too nitty gritty with the hints. But yes, Zamasu is a future unit. He's a regen unit. He's also a fusion warrior. So there's that. He's a god key and he's a powerful opponent. So Zamasu does hold many tags to him. So it could be a purple god key. It could be a purple powerful opponent. It could be a purple future. It could be a purple fusion warrior. Regen hasn't gotten anything a minute. I don't know. Zamasu has a lot more to him than the yellow Super Saiyan Goku, which is just pretty obviously a movies unit. I guess he's a Saiyan too and Sun Family, but yeah. So let me know your guys' thoughts. Do you think these two Zenkais returning to the shop are literally a hint for our anniversary units in terms of color and tag? Let me know who you think they could be in the comments down below. We'd love to hear your guys' thoughts. And as always, I hope y'all are staying happy and healthy, having the best of days, and I'll catch y'all tomorrow. <laughs>